Good morning class. Today we are coming to learn something about computer desktop. We say computer desktop. It refers to the initial surroundings when the PC or the computer is turned on. It is also refers to as the initial point for every Windows operation. Some features of computer desktops are recycle bin, the PC, the VLC, the IDM, Google Clone, Skype, and many more. Features of computer desktop are icons. If you say icons, what is the meaning? Icons is the smaller images that we see on the computer. Examples are programs, folders, files, etc. Some examples of icons as far as Word, PDS, PowerPoint, Excel, and so many more. Pictures of folders. Examples are desktop, my music. My pictures, favorites, my documents, links, and many more. Another feature on a computer desktop is taskbar. When you say a taskbar, it refers to the longest bar at the bottom of the screen with start menu, clock, etc on it here are some of the pictures of the desktop as concern about the taskbar another feature is the mouse pointer that's the arrow the arrow on the pc here are some design or how the L is represented on the desktop. Let us watch how to navigate a desktop computer. Let us watch a video of it. If you're just getting started with Windows, Learning how to navigate the desktop is a great way to start. Let's take a look at the desktop, which is the screen you see here. It includes a desktop background, also known as your wallpaper, and the taskbar at the bottom of the screen. The taskbar is where you'll find shortcuts to some of the applications on your computer, as well as the Start button. You can click the Start button to open the Start menu. Here you can see a list of applications. You can click an application to open it. You can also find shortcuts to your settings, documents, and more. The taskbar is also where you'll find the File Explorer. It allows you to view and open files and folders. For now, I'm going to close the window by clicking the X. Okay. Let's check out more features on the desktop. The desktop is the main workspace for your computer. To open a program file or folder, just double-click the icon. Each time you open something, it will appear in a new window. You have the ability to move windows by clicking and dragging the top of the window. When you're done, just release the mouse. If you have more than one window open at a time, you can quickly switch between them by clicking the one you want. Or you can click the icon for it on the taskbar. You can also maximize it so it fills the entire screen. Just click the square near the top right corner. Click it again to return the window to its original size. When you're finished, closing the windows is easy. Just click the X. If okay. you want to this quickly search the file settings or applications on your computer, on computer you can use the search feature. Just click the search bar and start typing, and it will show a list of results. Now you know the basics of getting around the Windows desktop. 
GCF Global. Okay. Navigating through the futures on the desktop. If you say navigating through computer desktop, this comprises moving the computer mouse cursor over the desktop icons and on the taskbar of the PC. Thank you for today's lesson.